Across our planet, old diseases are at work and new ones are rising. The pathogens that create disease, parasites, viruses, bacteria, are invisible enemies invading through the air, through the water, through animals, through people. It was absolutely essential to move aggressively in the development of biosciences here, to work on treatments for infectious diseases, detection of pathogens, and prevention of the spread of pathogens. These are critical for human health and for national security. At the Maryland Pathogen Research Institute, a place called EMPRI, scientists are building new weapons in the ancient war against pathogens. The Maryland Pathogen Research Institute brings together leaders in biosciences, computational sciences, engineering, and nanosciences. These collaborations within EMPRI share the goal of developing a comprehensive program to diagnose, treat, and prevent the spread of pathogens. When scientists are mixed together in uncommon combinations, the result is a new kind of energy. The true benefit of EMPRI to our faculty on campus is really the synergy which can be developed between researchers in different disciplines. Synergy is the secret weapon in the old war against pathogens. Microbiologist Dan Stein and organic chemist Philip Deschamps collaborated on a new way to deliver vaccines. At Empry, Synergy works, and it works with difficult diseases. To battle cystic fibrosis, a hidden killer that clogs human lungs with infectious pathogens, Empry brought together a cell biologist and a computer scientist. Vincent Lee studies pathogens that attack lungs, and Steven Salzberg is an expert on high-speed techniques for analyzing DNA sequences. The result, new ways to attack pathogens that attack human lungs. Practical payoffs from basic research. Many pathogens that attack the lungs are airborne. Some are so deadly they can be dangerous to scientists. At Empry, Brenda Fredrickson works on the West Nile virus in a biosafety level three lab. When I look at a pathway that inhibits West Nile replication, if I can develop a molecule that will trigger that pathway, I will not only block West Nile replication, but I may block other RNA virus, such as HIV, such as measles virus. Out of a recent disease like West Nile, Perhaps a new way to fight an old disease like measles can be found. That's not serendipity. That's synergy at work. These are all things that have come out of EMPRI, which would not happen at most research institutes because they're not built that way. EMPRI is built that way, and its synergy reaches well beyond the campus, creating collaborations with leading research institutions throughout the state the nation, and the world. And the payoffs can be profound. Deeper understandings of disease pathogens, as well as new vaccines, new products, and new technologies that can deliver new health weapons to a world at risk. <laughs>